Assalamu alaikum dear viewers, I am engineer Saifullah and you are watching Saifullah Engineer Insight YouTube channel. I hope that you all guys are doing well and you all will be fine. And I hope that you are enjoying our videos. So guys, today our video is based on the interviews for fresher engineers, the people who come to the Middle East, every GCC country, Saudi Arabia, Oman, Kuwait, Qatar, UAE. But nowadays the market in Saudi Arabia is good because they have uh, mega projects like Neom City, Line City, rehabilitation of Jeddah and uh, like uh, different projects they have to be honest and nowadays the market is so good. So inshallah today I will share some tips. Tips with you that how to prepare yourself for an engineering interview. What should you have to study, and what you have to main for? What will be your main focus for the interviews? A posting before starting our main video. I will request you to subscribe our channel if you like it, and like our videos if you find it uh, informative, and share it with your friends so they will be also get its benefits. Now you know. A lot of fresh engineers are coming to Saudi Arabia to find a job in the construction industries but when they come to the Saudi Arabia they are struggling especially the people who come with the Azad visa why they are struggling because they don't know how to write their CV and how to prepare themselves for the interviews and they are facing different issues some people are jobless for a uh, like a four months five months six months seven months like that but inshallah after this video you will not f face that issues so watch the video till the end and if you have any question further more so you can comment it in the comment box then i will try to give the answer there if it's not possible then i will make a separate video for that so now we will start our video let's see like if you are going to uh, see a job advertisement like for special for civil site engineer just like so when someone is going to are the searching for a civil site engineer are they forced a job advertisement in the description they also give that what will be the responsibilities and that project for the site engineers which they required so carefully read all the description of the job advertisement when you read all the job description then see it which things you know in the description and which things you have to know right and as per this that description try to update your cv how to update your cv try to take all the responsibilities from the description of the job advertisement and put in your cv and responsibility in your previous project which is I already told you in the previous video whenever you come to the Saudi Arabia update your CV and put all your experience in Saudi Arabia no problem if you have a you don't have the experience certificate this is not an issue so update your CV uh, job responsibilities as per that description of the advertisement now for example if they say say I will start engineer they have to make shop drawings so now you have to study how to prepare shop drawings how to guide a draftsman basically in uh, companies there are different draftsmen to make prepare shop drawings but the seven engineer should just to guide the, him just to review his uh, shop drawings if he has any comments so he will have to guide the draftsman and he will rectify the shop drawings if they say make mir wir wir mean work inspection request mir mean a material inspection request and i will um, inshallah uh, prepare separate videos on these uh, mir wir mar and if they are uh, asking for the mar material approval request so one by one check all the responsibilities study these responsibilities very well and when you uh, submit your cv to the recruiters so inshallah i hope they will choose your cv and they will call you for an interview that's it when you get a call for the interview after that 
as already i told you that update your cv as per that the responsibilities so study all the responsibilities very well what you have write in your cv job descriptions or job responsibilities for different projects you have to know each and everything about these responsibilities because mostly the mostly interviewer when they start uh, asking question interview first they will say introduce yourself this is like a general common question after that they will start ask the technical question from where they he will choose the technical question first he will check your cv and from that job description or job responsibilities he will try to ask the questions when you know very well about the job responsibilities which you write wrote in your cv so you have to give the do you have to uh, answer all the questions and you will be selected if in case he asked one two or three questions and their job responsibilities and you didn't answer him properly so he will think that this cv is spec and this guy don't know about his job so he will say goodbye so i will summarize it whenever you see a job advertisement on linkedin expatriate or any other website just uh, read its uh, description job uh, advertisement uh, job responsibility description try to update your cv as per that description and when you receive the call for interview study all the responsibilities which you wrote on your cv very well and after that when you went for the interview and he will ask that questions and the and he will choose the questions from the cv and you will answer him the properly so you will get the job inshallah so if you have any question furthermore please ask it in the comment box and i will try to answer that question so guys please subscribe our youtube channel for more such videos thank you so much for watching our video